Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Chrono Cross. Today we're going to be doing the Fire Dragon and trying to complete some side quests here and there. So first, what I want to do is, I wonder if the whole Marbul, like saving Marbul thing is ready yet? So I'm going to quickly head to Fargo. Alright, let's go see what he says. He should be right inside of here. Alright, I grabbed the other Fargo. Let's see what this guy has to say to himself. Uh, he should fall kind of in line. I, landlubber. <laughs> Are you me? Don't even associate yourself with me. You're being a sissy, Fargo. You're pathetic. I too had the possibility of becoming a jelly like yourself. I know about the plan. We're moving the ship along with Nikki, with Nikki's to Marbul and showering the island with this song at full volume. Once the dream spirits awaken, we'll defeat them one by one. My ship, the Zelbus, the ship cannot lo can no longer set sail. I cannot steer it. Ah, who's asking you anyway? Listen up, mateys. The ship is no longer the Zelbus, but the SS Invincible. Set course for Marbul and man your stations. It's useless. We'll see about that. So yeah, I knew I had to get my other boy Fargo. Except, for, come on everyone, we're going to take our beautiful island marble back. Hopefully I can switch characters, because I don't want to fight with Fargo. I want to get Robot, Mr. Roboto back in my team. So hopefully they'll let me do that. Oh, Eve, oh. How the? You don't even know that? The desire to return to ones is steering the ship forward. You mean the demi humans? Once the ship reaches Marble, Nikki will begin this concert. We gotta do what we can to wake these monsters from their nightmares. So long, Fargo. I've come to my senses. It's time you did the same. Hee <laughs> hee. Looks like they finally did it. Behold, my people. Mar. Mar. Man, I can't say words. Well then, it's about time we get down to business. Oh, that's dumb. That's actually... That, we didn't finish a battle. That's just their music. Oh boy. Let's defeat some Lagoonates. Adrift, adrift. For how many dreams have I awakened? How many marrows have I passed? The days when victory meant everything have come to an end. Yesterday's friends become tomorrow's foes. So flow the days filled with betrayal and um, something something. One, once one reaches the summit, all that remains is one inevitable downfall. All has become lost. The innumerable wounds, once decorations of glory, have become instead to ache. Ah, have I awoken? Where I be? Could this be the grave of the narwhals that is said to lie hidden in the sea? Bro, I don't know. But there's Mickey and Nikki and the two other dancers who I don't really know who they are. They're probably not important. They don't even have names. Uh, they, they took Nikki down. Now he's probably going to start singing, isn't he? But we shall free the island. Bam, he's up. Where am I? You're on a ship, my dude. So, I am alone. Just dessert, just desserts for the likes of me. I like desserts. Except I just had, like, McDonald's, so I'm not really hungry. Betrayed by the very ones whom I trust that gone are the friends with whom I shared my dreams alone with no lover to share my sorrows. Oh, hither. Someone behind you. Someone in front of you. Is someone hither? Oh, hither. Be it thou, my savior sweet, I... Oh my god, I don't want to read all this. Be thou not a mere maiden, but a mermaid. <laughs> thou art surprised. Only that one such as thee would help a human like me. My internal gratitude is thine, sweet siren of the sea. So she's supposed to be like a mermaid, obviously, from Marble. 
Uh, Twas but the proper thing. Why art thou alone here? Whence cometh the wounds that afflict thee so? Tis too sad a tale to tell so far. So fair. If thou wishes not to speak of such things, I shan't enforce thee to tell them unto me. Instead, kind sir, may I inquire as to the world from which thou cometh, comest. Man. I, I never said I was greatest reader, though. Enough, that shall suffice. What a wretched, woeful tale thou ha hast. Thou need needest not fight er more. The world from whence thou comest lack any form of pleasure. Pleasure. Dear sailor man, let me hear the song that thou dost like best. A splendid song from a faraway world, unknown to the likes of me. A song of such a thing I know not. Wherefore wouldst thou hear my cronies, Neptunian nymph? Surely this is not to be gained from it. Bro, come on, man. Just sing your song. What a poor, miserable man thou art. Songs be the soul's delight. When one is sad, songs gently envelop one's sorrows. And when one is happy, songs are there to share the joy with thee. That be the very essence of song. So thou sayest, unfortunately, singing has no relevance to me. I long ago forgot how to laugh and how to cry. I need some water up in here. Oh, God. She gonna start singing? How awfully nostalgic. I feel as though I have heard that song before, somewhere long ago. A mysterious melody that bathes thee in a warm glow. It is a precious song handed down generation to generation on my island. It seems to have reached the heart of thee who knows not of song. Now make me a promise. Repay me for saving you by singing the song for me. Hold on. Such a thing I cannot do. Cannot is different from will not. Please promise to grant this one petition. Wait, do not go. Where'd she go? Wow! He's got a guitar now. Sigh, as thought, I am unable to perform such music. Thou seem troubled. So this guy is literally performing a play. Who might ye be? Our sister shan't come out again until thou singest. Please, I beg ye, teach me how to sing. Music and song are not something that thou canst teach. There are things that thou must feel first. Blah, blah, blah. Honestly, I've never, I never really liked Nikki as a character. I'm just gonna be honest. I think I said this earlier uh, when we had the decision to either pick him. I never pick him. I don't really like him, honestly. This is terrible. Tis void of all emotion. Even this, this is a little bit stale. Thou dost need to be a bard, so as long thou express thy feelings, the thoughts of thy heart that words cannot. Probably just shouldn't have started the episode off with this. Maybe that would have been a good idea. Let thy instrument tell us what thou want to say. Just better keep it up. <laughs> okay, keep it up. Thank you. This is the song of marble. Thou art a kind man, we can tell from the sound thou makest. Hee hee, thou hast got it. A, hey, tis becoming fun. Hmm. Alright, where's Mickey ass? Real question. There she is. Ooh. 
well, what dost thou think? Tis beautiful, each note enwraps my very soul. If ever thou art sorrowed and at the despair limp, oh, but then croon this song, remember, dear, this very moment. The time when our hearts began to beat to one rhythm and know that our song will continue on forever meter. Lo, the star th the stars doth twinkle in accord with our song. The brighter one is the star of something, and next to it the star of Grania can be seen shining so faintly. We mar mariners, mariners, navigate our vessels by these two stars. Thou art a knowledgeable man, I not know the names of such luminaries. I just saw them as jewels that shine in the night sky. I didn't realize that stars could look so beautiful. I never took the time to gaze at them like this before, nor ever heard the song that they had been singing unto me. Now that I have spent what seems like days singing here with thee, I have come to the realization that there is no more than what seems to be. The twinkling of the stars, the waving of the waves, even silence itself, all sing in harmony with thee and me. It is strange to think that both thy world and mine share the same stars. Speaking of which, I must soon return to my world. Wherefore, dear sir, thou dost not like it here? Their pursuers are nigh, my staying here will endanger thy folk. Then allow me to come with thee, sweet sir. I cannot allow such thing. One step out of here lie treacherous temp tempests and woeful warfare. Yet even then, even then thou dost say thou shalt come with me. I know that for a certainty. Yet for this place only to have a peace while the whole world is at war is a selfish itself. Perhaps the love we share can be shared with the whole world. Both nature and mankind must surely desire to live hand in hand. Thou comest thou to me, my sweetest sea sprite, until the whole world hath come to live in heavenly harmony. Upon the day shall I bring thee back to the idyllic isle. Then, only then, will both our worlds have peace between nature and human folk and resonate in chorus with our national anthem dear national. Together, let us build the whole new world. Come, my maiden, come. Like, come on, bro. Like, I like this, but, like, <laughs> I don't know, man. Speed this up a bit, you know what I mean? The only reason I'm even doing this is because I want <laughs> Mickey in my party. Or, not my party, but, like, I, I want to grab her as a playable character. Oh, Zelbez, does this song call out to your heart? You taught me this song for long. I've been trying to regain what I've lost, but to no avail. But now I feel as if the one important thing I finally returned, thanks to the irreplaceable treasure you left behind. So you're happy for me, too. Even though she said that, I too was unable to fulfill the promise made to Zelbez. Her dream is also my dream. I promise never to use this attack again, but there's no avoiding it. Please forgive me. This time I'll protect you. Oh. So that is a new move? That's interesting. Alright then, I'll show you how serious I can get. It's time for me to let loose some marble. Alright, let's get it. Um... Do I have to have Fargo on my team? You know what, guys? I think I'll leave Mr. Roboto out of this battle this one time. The Great Explorer. Yo, you guys, I'm sure you noticed, but something ain't right. I know they're harmless, but they've grown in number. And if, these, if these monsters are somebody's bad dream, then whose or what's dream? Then does that mean that if these monsters die, someone or something will wake up? I bet the dreamer is ten times as nasty as these nightmares. There's probably something big. Uh, I think we're about done here. Er, yeah, well, I think I'm through with my investigation here. Don't get the wrong idea. It's not that I'm scared or anything. We'll take care. Alright, let's beat up some Lagoonates, man. Get out of here, bro. What's up? Fight me. Alright, so we're gonna have to fight each of these Lagoonates. And they shouldn't be tough. I think they have about 500 health, 510. Just four kicks. Though, although I... They're pretty strong, I think. 
Never mind, they're pretty weak. I take back my words. But they do still do have a bit of health. So let's use Infernal. That would probably hurt quite a bit. I'll probably hurt hurt him. It should probably kill the one on the right if it does enough damage. 250, jeez. You know, I will use Fargo. I don't have, like, anything equipped on him. But he should do a decent amount of health. I don't know how I don't know how much Irene does. But we could probably just go in with Lynx and finish this one off. If he hits it. Nice. Okay. Yeah, these things aren't as hard as I thought. Maybe we could come to this island earlier and I didn't know. Not sure. There we got two resistance rings that we can't really do anything with. But yeah. We gotta clear all the lagoon in, so at this point it's just kind of grinding. We gotta get these done. Alright everybody, we've cleared all the lagoonates except one. So we're gonna fight this last one on camera and I don't really know what to do after. Do we have to go to the hut? Do we have to go to the map? Does it automatically do something? I don't know. But just in case it is automatic, we're gonna do this last fight together. And of course, for the first time ever, Lynx misses twice. He made up for the beginning where he missed two by hitting that crazy critical. Alright, let's see. Let's heal just in case there's another fight, which I don't think there is. A dragon's cry was heard in a far off distance. Okay. I mean, I know which dragon that is, I think. Is there a dragon in here? There's not a dragon in Wait. Alright guys, real quickly, I'm gonna go to the other world and see if it made a difference. I don't see why it would, but I, I just didn't want them, so... Oh. Hey, look at that! They're back! If you're with a human, get out. Bro, you wanna fight? The black dragon, it's awake. Okay, so maybe... Doing that did wake it up. Maybe it did. This is the sage. The black dragon has awakened even without our song. What could have happened? Well, the song has been sung in another world. That's what happened, my dude. Is there a safe point? You know what? We're not gonna die to this dragon. This is probably a really dumb idea, but you know what? I'm going in, boys. Oh, I still have Fargo with me. Oops. I still have Fargo. Right, yeah, yo, can you not wake up yet? Yo, 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 don't wake up yet, don't you? Don't wake up. <laughs> We're gonna go and uh, quickly switch out Fargo. Because that's probably a great idea. Dragon uh, is also black. So, my elements won't be super effective against them. This should be fine, though. Yo, what's good? dragon yo want a duel and this one's actually the only one that actually looks like a dragon yo can i talk to you it hath been a long sleep i am you shall provide some much needed exercise all right bro let's do this and he's not in my opinion he's not as bad as a green dragon this guy's like all right i just woke up need to get him some cardio you guys can help me out no the green one was like dude there's some lunch so although the black dragon is also kind of a jerk at least he didn't call us lunch. That offends me. Alright, we're gonna get some big hits on him here. And then let's get a Photon Beam. This dude is black, so Photon Beam should do quite a bit of damage to his face. Boom. It should do quite a bit. 193? Okay. Anti-white. Oh! We literally just pulled out a white spell right before he made us not be able to. That's, that's fine though. I don't want to miss, so I'm just going to go ahead with a 1. Ah, uh, man, he's not... Okay, that last one was a pretty big hit. Let's just hit him with everything we got, you know what I mean? Let's just hit it. With Irene. I'm going to get a heal ready with her. Oh, he stopped me. He stopped me from doing another attack. I, th I don't know if that's going to reset. Ooh, oh, that doesn't hurt that bad. I oh, hurt kind of bad. I'm not sure if that resets my percentages, it doesn't. But he might missed. 
Let's go to Lynx. Don't miss. Good stuff. Aw, oh, you missed the second one, you butt. Alright, let's go with her. Let's make sure we get our healing up. Okay, there we go. I want to make sure I'll be able to heal. Dark Breath, how much does that do? And is that to everybody? That's the real question. How strong is that? Show me. Okay. Not that strong. Okay. That is a okay. Uh, you know what? Nah, I won't even heal. I might heal with Mr. Roboto over here. Since he doesn't have the best healing, I as well just do it with him. If it'll let me heal before he attacks again. Uh, okay, that's fine. He's not gonna kill anybody. Yeah, that's actually the probably the best person he could have attacked. And actually, now it's probably is useful to heal, so I'm gonna go back to Irene. And use... No, I'm not gonna even use the big heal all. Let's just heal the... Let's just do the normal heal all. And this should be about a 200. That'll be more than enough. Yep. More than enough. Please, let's hit the three. Nice, hit the second one. Nope, not seal all. Let's do... Let's hit him with an ice blast right in the middle of the body. How about that? That probably feels good, don't it? Boom. Nice. Ooh. Uh, let's see. Ah, why well, you gotta miss, bro? All right, hit the second one at least. Genius. I'm pretty sure that just raises his stuff up, right? His defense? Magic defense. Gravity bomb. Uh, wait. I don't think this is... Is this, this, is, a, is this a big attack? I don't know if this is a big attack. Is it? Oh, it looks like it. Okay, okay. That was pretty strong, pretty strong. Not too strong, though. Luckily, um, we got Mr. Healing over here. Let's just heal up. Probably not gonna heal us to full. Probably not. Yeah, yeah, actually, no, we're all full. Okay, good. Please don't miss. Yes, good. Is he low already? I don't, I don't know. Oh, I can't. Oh, I still hit. Look at that. You know what? Let's hit him with that meteor shower, bro. Let's do this. Since my um, accuracy is so low, might as well just hit him with a spell while I'm at it. Probably got nothing better to do anyway. Either got to heal him or wait for that black to wear off. But Lynx is... Uh, mm. His main damage comes from healing. I wonder, do I have like a heal? I don't think I do. Hmm, that's fine. Let's just defend. Defend. Oh, that's good. Um, well, that I think that'll take away his. Maybe. I, I guess we'll see. Does it go away when he gets hit? Man, I'm at like the end of the game. I still don't know this. No, it doesn't look like it. Well, let's just try to hit a 35. Hey, my boy still got it. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna wait. Maybe I can use that that P whatever medicine to get rid of that. Looks like this dude is low though. So I'm just gonna maybe I should just like rush him now. Just make him dead. Damn. If I make him dead, you know, that's that's good stuff. Lynx, can you attack yet? Okay, let's see. Good. Good. Gravitone. Ah, eh, won't hurt that much. Maybe about 60 to 70 each. Even lower. We could use this on me. Oh, I can't use that? Dang it. Can I not use... Oh, I can't use white stuff. Oh, that's dumb. Ah, uh, you know, that's fine. Uh, let's go and, uh, let's burn them all. Why not? Let's go ahead and make this place explode with some infernos. Okay. Uh, man, I still can't hit. When will that go away? For now, though, uh, let's just do an ice blast. This fight's gonna end real soon anyway. There's no reason for me to just not do anything. Oh, he's low now. Okay, now he's low. Let's go ahead and defend. Free fall. Oh, this might hurt a bit. 
And actually, Lynx is his his color is black anyway. It won't hurt him that much. Oh, okay, I hurt him quite a bit. Okay, let's go to Irene. Let's try to get a heal ready. Hopefully, this doesn't trigger him to attack. Good. Uh, let's just cure all. I probably shouldn't have used cure all for such like low percentage, but yeah, he's gonna be dead either way. My accuracy is back. And I miss anyway. Alright, he's gonna go for Lynx a little bit. That's fine. Lynx is probably the highest defense. So it's probably good that he's getting hit. Let's go over here to Mr. Roboto. My hit. Nice. Boom. Good. Back to Lynx. Tag team up in here. No! Lynx, bro. Lynx has a really bad habit of missing near the end of fights. I don't know what it is. Go through all 25 or so videos so far. Check every boss fight. I bet you more than half of them he starts missing at the end for no apparent reason. It doesn't make any sense. Alright, that doesn't hurt that much. Yeah. Wait, is he gonna do it again? Or. Oh no, okay. Let's go up in here and. Just for shape, safety. Just for safety measures. Let's go ahead and. Uh, do a little bit of that heal heal real quick. Bam. Bam. Well, what am I doing? Let me go attack with Lynx. Try to finish him. Please hit both. Yes. Nice. Is he dead? No, but he's going to tag him. But that's fine. He's not going to do anything too badly. Boom. Ba -na 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 -na. Is he dead? Yes! We done it. Good stuff. Oh, he's angry. Boom. Boom, boom, ba na 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 Boom, na 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 The black dragon's dead. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. We got Grim Reaper. That's a good... That's... Wait, we could put that on one of them, I think. Hey, that'd be sick. Aha, I thank you for the excitement. Uh, Black Relic. Sick Arino. Nice. All right. Cool stuff. Let's see if we can actually equip it. Uh, yeah, by the way, Marble, sorry for, like, uh, uh, destroying your dragon. Uh, let's go. Let's put it on Link, since obviously he's, like, my main character anyway. Let's go see if we can put it on him. Does he have... No, it has to go on eight, don't it? Yes, it has to be on 8. Does he have 8? 4, 5, 6, 7. No, not yet. Alright. Well then, we shall give it a bit more time. By the way, I can never use her like ultimate ability because I don't have turn blue. I need, I need to turn the field blue. I don't even know if I have it. I definitely need to grab it though from somewhere eventually. Anyway, um, I don't think we're gonna do another dragon fight in this episode, but let's for sure at least head to Mount Pyre. Uh, let's at least head there. And uh, I just know why I don't know why I walked back in here. I'm trying to think of what world he's in. I'm pretty sure. It's in this world. I'm almost sure it's in this world. So let's go ahead and dock up. I'm pretty sure. If we see the if we see the big boy, then we'll know that it is this place. We just gotta see if that big spooky dragon's here. And everything's already pre-frozen for us, so that's pretty good. And obviously I'm just gonna run past these guys. I don't really have no beef with them. And obviously, I'd like one shot him anyway. Basically, I just want the dragon itself. No! That's all right. We, we Gucci. There we go. All right, now try to get past this coyote without getting hit. Bro, I was like, don't, don't chase me, bro. All right. We should be good. We should be good. And the fire dragon should be past this next room. We can dodge this lava boy. We're in the clear. Alright, we're in the clear. Wait, wait, no. One more. There we go. Now we just gotta run past him. Like that. 
good stuff. And there's a save point here. So guys, uh, let's save here. Um, real quickly, I'm not gonna end the episode. Let's check if he is here. Because if he's not here, obviously I'm gonna have to go to the other world. So let's just walk in here and take a quick peek. Is he here? Yes, he is here. Uh, but obviously we can't just like go there. What we're gonna have to do is go around, sadly. Alright, you know what? I just defeated the crap out of that one. I didn't feel like dealing with it. I'm pretty sure... Do we have to go here? No, but there's a chest. Tablet. I really don't need a tablet. I know, it's, I know what we have to do. We have to go... Don't hit me. We have to go down. Towards the right. Left. It's the right. Oh, we just gotta... Oh, we gotta dodge this. Alright, let's go to this side. Pro dodging with Aqua. Alright, we just gotta dodge this boy. No, get away! Oh, okay, that one's just facing the wall. Like a complete idiot. Oh, okay, we've never been here yet, but this is obviously where we're supposed to go. Sadly, that stupid line thing is not stuck. Alright, we are back up. Let's try the other route. Let's try to run this way. Oh, okay. Uh, magma bomb. No. Oh, I was so scared I slipped. Now. Oh, this is the way. Okay, that makes sense. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and do another freezy freeze. Uh, freeze for me. Bam. Right, let's try to dodge these doggos. Dodge the doggos. Dodge, dodge the doggo. The doggos. The doogos. Alright. Oof. No. Oh. So many. Oh. Oh, we made it. We're geniuses. Look at that. Oh. Okay. We will end off here, guys. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, the next time we're going to fight that fire dragon. Make sure to like. Oh. Totally messed up my outro. Make sure to like and comment as a support to my channel. And I'll see you guys later. God bless. And goodbye.